Coming up next, it's a lightweight championship fight between Bruce Lee and Dustin Poirier. All right, here he is, the number one lightweight contender making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. All right, here he is, the reigning defending undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Of course, the target is on his back. All eyes are on this man tonight as he tries to make good on yet another title defense. He has owned this division for some time. The question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25 minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. The action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 24 wins, five losses, and one no contest. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Palama, presenting the challenger, this man, the driver. Now introducing the champion, fighting out of the left corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bruce. All right, this is for the championship bout. I want you guys to do a clean fight. Follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Good luck tonight. Touch gloves. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go down right now. All right, we are underway here at the famed Madison Square Garden right in New York City. Just unable to quite find that range. Look at that. Nice. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Watch out! Oh! Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? He's got hurt here. Very nice. Yeah, he's... Digging into that leg kick. Big left. 
so unguarded right into the pocket, and as such, he leads right into that uppercut, left the head wide open, and I'm not sure how many more of those, Joe, he's gonna be able to take. Let's see if he gets the hands up, tries to circle out, and get that head off the center line. He got tagged there. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Try to establish that jab. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. Straight punch there again. Been there all night. Poirier gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Oh, both men exchange. Big oh, right hand. Massive right hand. Hard jab. Oh. This could be it. Vicious combinations. The champion is in big trouble here. He is in danger of losing his title. Oh, he might be out. Poirier gets in the clinch yet again. Staying busy in the clinch to avoid a separation. Huge knee to the body. Oh, straight right. Oh, he oh. missed that kick. He front kicked him in the face. He's got him hurt here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He hurt him with that hook. Head kick. What a jab. Poirier's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. And he lands the hook. Round two straight ahead. Stop, stop, stop. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. And here's a perfectly placed kick that really does damage. Incredible highlights in that round. Relax, you're okay. Everything's gonna be fine. Listen. Brittany Palmer with us. All right, let's get to round two. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. How about that shin? Well, he's landed some excellent shots. Oh! Huge hand! hand! This could be it right here. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Poirier. Big power shot there. Oh, man, defensively leaving a lot to be desired there. He moved right into that hook. His head was wide open. And oh! He got hurt bad. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Slightly deflected. Just misses there with the left. It appears a cut has opened up on his cheek. Didn't quite connect. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Under two minutes now in round two. Pummels in and double underhooks. Tying oh! him up here in the clinch. Elbow to the head, he's stunned. He's got him hurt here. That one appeared to stun him. Oh! 
Now goes in and secures the takedown. All right, so he just decides to get up here, Joe. He's out! He is hurt! Indeed, Joe, that was a tremendous kick to end the fight tonight. Caught the opponent flush with full force and extension. And frankly, there was no chance after that. The fight was over as soon as that one made contact. Certainly one for the highlight reel here tonight. Caught him right there, had him in all sorts of trouble. Great angle here. And he's out. And there is the UFC lightweight champion proving tonight he can not just get it done, but get it done with style points as he gets the knockout to leave with the goal. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is going to stop in this contest at four minutes, 24 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and new UFC lightweight champion of the So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion here tonight, the longtime in